friends, I made a new necklace. Ta -da! So, I want to show it to you. And uh, now, take a look closely. Come on. Okay, this is the necklace. I bezelled a uh, resin cabochon I made. This is uh, one of the resin cabochon I made. Inside the cabochon, uh, there are some very, very, very small um, bolts. Are like beads, but uh, they haven't the hole inside, okay? Um, so I made this uh, cabochon with resin and then I bezelled one of them and I started with some very, very big uh, beads because I used some hematite beads size 6, very big. And I like uh, to start uh, to bezel a cabochon very big with very big beads because in this way I can surround very well all the surface of my cabochon, okay? So, I started with my uh, hematite seed beads size 6 and then I decrease uh, the size of my beads and I use these light blue beads size 8, uh, these uh, mm, hematite beads size 8, uh, light blue beads and hematite beads are the same size but the, the hematite beads l looks like uh, they are smaller because of the color because they are black dark okay and then I used some delicate beads size 10 and so I completed the bezel. Okay, and then I made my crochet rope. Really very simple. I used the same beads and the sequence that I used to create this crochet spiral um, is one delicate bead size 10, two seed beads size 8, one hematite and then one light blue. Then I put on my thread one seed bead size 6, the biggest bead of the sequence, and then one light blue bead size 6 and another hematite seed bead size and then and then another hematite seed bead size 6 okay and i repeat this sequence i put this sequence several times on my thread and then i start to work with my crochet and this is what i got then i put my end caps here and I finish my work, really very simple. I think that this beadwork has a really good effect because of the position of the color. It seems like there is a picture on my, on my beadwork, but the, the technique is really very simple, just peyote stitch and crochet rope for the necklace, okay? As always, I hope that this my creation can be an inspiration for you. Um, follow me on Facebook. If you have the account, uh, facebook.com slash beatsfriends. And see you soon in the next video. Bye. Bye bye.